All right, Brad Whitten here, AKA The Real Fireman on all other social media sites. Today, we're gonna go over the water knot that's only tied in your web. It can be simple for uh, a lot of people, but it can also be extremely difficult to remember exactly how to tie it up. People wanna just tie this thing in knots and whatever and mess it all up. So, here's how it goes. Very simple, take one end, you get about eh, maybe two feet worth, and you just tie a regular old, Regular old knot. See, just regular old knot. Don't pull it real tight, but get it kind of flat and snug. You want it to make a triangle, just like that right there. Okay. Then, you take the other end of your webbing. And some people say, well, I don't know which side to start my webbing to follow through with the other side. Start with your tag line side. Wherever it goes through right there, that's where you start your other end. Like this right here. You stick it through there where your tag line comes through. The blue webbing might not have been the best color for this video because it's hard to see. So you start like that. You want to pull you about the same amount of webbing through there. Because you're just going to follow it through, right? And you just follow your other side. And where it goes, that's where this one goes. Comes around. Tuck it in. Make sure everything straight and flat. Your tag line should be about the same length. Y'all see them right there? About the same length. Tighten it, snug it, dress it up. And it should make a nice little pretty flat triangle, just like that. That's the water knot. Now you can take and tie safeties on each end of the knot if you want to but I don't really think it's necessary. Once you pull this thing tight, it gets real snug. We're gonna go over it one more time. Y'all know how I do. Break it down varnish style, and we always go over the knots twice, because I want y'all to learn the knots. I don't want to just be out here showing you. I want y'all to actually learn them and see how it works. All right. So I don't have to bend over no more. We're gonna throw that over the shoulder. All right, here we go. So on this side, you get about, I'm thinking that's probably, foot and a half, two feet worth. And you just tie a regular knot, right? I guess you can call that overhead knot, granny knot, whatever you want to call it. It's just a regular old, regular old knot. And again, you don't snug it all the way down because you got to put the other end through. You want it to be kind of loose. So maybe hold your fingers in there is what I like to do to hold the gap open. That should tag in with, see how it goes through right there? That's the side you're going to start your other one in. And that'll make sure your tag line comes out the other side like it's supposed to. So you take this in. You want to pull about the same amount on the other side. That way your tag lines will match on either side, right? And then you just follow. So it goes behind. So I went behind. It comes around. You see where it goes right there? This one's going to go to the same spot. You see how on the back side it tucks in right there? We're going to tuck this in and come out the other side. All you're doing is following your other line. That's all you're doing. Come out the other side, and then you just dress it up, kind of pull it. And right here, if you want that to be permanent, then you can pull it really tight, which I'm going to, because I'm gonna put this back in my turnouts as my webbing. So I'm gonna pull it kind of tight. It makes a nice little pretty flat train. Tag line's about the same length because you pulled them about the same from the beginning. And again, you can tie safeties on both sides if you want to. That's personal preference. You don't have to. The good old water knot that only goes in your web. Hey, look, again, if you like my content, you like what I'm showing you, you're actually learning something, hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. It'll send you a notification every time I post up a new video. It's like a text message. Y'all have a good one. Real fireman stuff.